What are we doing? Uh, what are we doing is the what question. Hello. Welcome to the annual meeting of the Home Ventilating Institute, which is one of the supporters of Home Diagnosis Season 2. There are huge brains in this room, and one of the hugest is here that's oh, considerably stop. bigger. Mostly it's his hairdo that does it. But <laughs> yeah, this that's is, right. This is Ian Walker, who oh. is blower door savvy way past me, mm -hmm. ventilation savvy way past me. In fact, you have been answering emails, I believe, all day long from people who are angry with you about ASHRAE 62.2. Yeah, it's all just part of my life. He's the chair of the ASHRAE 62.2. Uh, you can apparently find his email address online if you search. I will not give it to you here. Um, don't write to him. This this is the thing. Just just program for Ashri 62.2 ventilation number and then turn it up if you need to and turn it down if you need to. Does that sound reasonable? Okay. Okay, great, done. No more conversation about that. Now, here's the thing. Ian uh, presented on some studies today about ventilation and they, they um, tested 250 homes in California? 70 homes in California. 70. So 70. 250 divided by whatever that is, which I'm not the enough of a scientist to know what that is. are in the rest of the country and we're testing them now. The okay. rest of 250. Okay. Coming so, along. So, a lot, 70 so, so far of those, though, yeah. whether they're in California or Florida or wherever they are, yeah. you found that you have a rule that like if a house has, if four houses have ventilation oh. systems installed, how uh -huh. many of them actually run when you visit them a year later? One out of four. Okay. So 25% of, of all the ventilation systems that Ian is actually testing and looking, just go on, visit. Is it on? No, yeah. it's not on. So this is something that we need to worry about. In the town, the homes that you're looking at are not necessarily super airtight. No, they're not. They're California homes, so they're not airtight like you would expect in some sort of energy efficiency program, or they don't meet IEC requirements. Right. Okay. So, but but we need to pay attention to this, and you can help with this by making sure that your friends and family and your neighbors know that they need ventilation. We need kitchen ventilation. Is that important? Yes. What uh, most important? Uh, no, second most important. Ooh, what's the first most important? I would say you just got to ventilate the whole house. Do do that first. Okay. So bath fans. Yeah. You, so, something should be ventilating all the time. Whole house all right. ventilation. That's what I'm talking okay, about. Okay. All right. Cool. Because even if it's if your house is leaky, this is something that we get on this channel. It's like, well, my house is. I know my house is leaky. Yeah. It's got natural infiltration. Not necessarily. If, and, and certainly not all the time. Not all the time, right? If the wind's not blowing, if the temperature outside is not extreme, then you don't there's get no ventilation yeah. at all. So we need to be controlling this stuff. And this is the place where we're doing this. You're going to see a lot more videos with these people. HVI is made of all of the manufacturers of ventilation equipment. They all got together and said, "All right, let's play by the same rules." And they have independent testing. It's it's very cool. So you presented twice today. Yeah, twice. Awesome. Again, again tomorrow. And, and again tomorrow. So he's presenting three times more than I uh, did. I presented this morning at 8.15 in the morning. I did not eat my breakfast beforehand. Ian had to listen to me chewing my sausage uh, <laughs> during the meeting. So um, anyway, this is really important stuff. I'm going to have another video with Ian talking about some blower door nerd out stuff. So stay tuned for that as well. And um, make sure that you pay attention to Home Diagnosis Season 2. We just uh, filmed episodes 5, 6, 7. Talk to you soon. Okay, bye.